Welcome to the Think Tank. Okay, so the sarcomere, it is where the muscles contract and they um, they contract and they overlap each other. This this part right here is the I band, which is the part of the thin filament, which is the actin. The H zone is the part of the myosin, which is the thicker filaments. The A band is the part where myosin and actin overlap each other. That's where the muscles contract with the help of ATP. But wait, within that, doesn't the um, myosin and actin filaments have to cross over each other? And is that the H zone? I think you're right, Darius. I think we're on to something. We're on to something. How do they contract? Well, the muscle impulses from the motor neurons are supposed to activate the contraction. Oh man. I think we got it. Great discovery. Yeah. And over here, so this will explain why, once the, uh, once the action potential reaches motor neurons into your arm, into your biceps, that triggers the um, electrical impulse to stimulate the contraction of the muscle. And that's when myosin and actin and overlap A -band. to form the H zone. Yes. Yes. But why? Because we need to understand how muscle contraction works so we can make it more efficient. How are we going to make this work? You got it. Sugar. I got it. Sugar. You may be on to something. Spice. <gasps> there it is. We got it. <laughs> Are you trying to get back? There's all the shit on the table. Okay, go. What's going on? Why is it so small? This isn't common core. <laughs> This awesome! 